Okay, this is my Dollar Tree haul. And as you can see, there's quite a bit of skull things. Um, I am a skull junkie. I love anything that has to do with skulls. We'll start with Henry over here on the crock pot. I've uh, got this skeleton head. I'm going to put it on my mantle, I think. I got these cute Halloween um, wooden, wooden, they just stand up, the wood, but harvest or have a spooktacular Halloween, tis the season to be spooky and spider venom. That's what I got, got an apple juice. I got a lot of spices. I make my own rubs and make my own taco seasoning, my own ranch powder, my own everything. And um, so I got chili powder, cilantro leaves. I want to try this Cajun style um, all-purpose seasoning. Got ground paprika, cumin, this garlic and herb I saw on some other YouTube videos. And I want to try it on some chicken that I'm going to make this week. Some crock pot chicken. Got some everything bagel seasoning because I love bagels. Cayenne pepper, thyme, some salt. Oh, you can't see, can you? Oregano leaves. A lot of the recipes I use uh, or that I make have uh, oregano in them, the spice mixes, and some chopped chives. These are great on loaded baked potatoes. And in the back, well, I got a slotted spoon. A lemon or lime juicer a whisk I got three of these skulls that stand up I'm not sure where I'm going to put them yet but I'm going to put them somewhere um, I've already used one of these skull buckets to put my forks in on my kitchen table got some aluminum foil um, what is this parsley flakes got three boxes of sazon this is the best stuff if you're going to make anything mexican taco fajitas carnitas um any kind of beef that you want to make that's mexican this stuff is great i got a skull that tilts or that rolls a cat skull that rolls um these pumpkin hands with skeleton hands i love those i'll probably put those um on the mantle and i thought these were the coolest things these are actually chair covers and i got them at dollar tree and i already tried it and they do fit my chair so i'll show you a picture of that when when my haul's over got three of these stainless steel bowls for measuring um I do like to keep things looking, um, you know, tight and have measurements. So those I thought were really cute. And speaking of measurements, I just went ahead and got another set of um, measuring spoons because I'm going to be making um, the uh, all those seasonings, and I'm going to make a video of that. Got a little bear clip. My little nephew, when he comes, my little nephew, when he comes, he loves to get into the chips. Uh, got some glad bag for the seasoning. Got a container for the seasonings. Got some tuna. Already got into the batteries. Got some more clips. Got a hundred grand that I do not need. Some face wipes. Some ouchless uh, rubbers for your hair. Some baking powder, some freeze dried strawberry bananas, and then I got these cute things. These, this is a door cover. I think I'm going to give to my nephew to put over his door because I already have one. And then I got this gigantic skeleton that I'm going to hang on my on the front of my house. So that is, I think, everything. Um, this haul was, I want to say. $85, I want to say, but I'm not, I'm, I'd, I'd have to look at the receipt and it's in the car. 
But so there's a lot of Halloween stuff. I love skulls. Um, I've already bought a ton of Halloween stuff. Um, you'll see in my videos that I have Halloween stuff on my table and around the house. So I'm going to go find a home for Henry over there. That's on the crock pot. We can't leave him there. And um, yeah, and I'll take a picture of the chair cover because it's really cute. Thanks for joining me for this haul. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you subscribe. There will be more hauls to come and uh, more videos. So have a wonderful day. Uh, I hope you have a very great evening. It's about 7 o'clock here. Uh, time for dinner. So we're going to go find something for dinner. And put this stuff away. Have a great night everyone.